14 year old shot and killed at a Conway area bar and a community now left to grieve. The school district says the teen was a student at Loris High School. That shooting happened at the one and done bar off Highway 544. That's where we find Ali Espinosa tonight. And Ali, you've been speaking with people who knew that teen. What did they tell you about him? Yeah, Eric and Rachel, Caleb Brown was just a freshman here at Loris High School, and he was also a part of the football team here. Now, those who knew him say he had a bright future ahead of him and was taken too soon. 14-year-old Caleb Brown was just weeks away from finishing his first year of high school, but his life was cut short by a bullet. Horry County police officers rushed to the one and done bar just after midnight Saturday after receiving a shots fired call. The bar is located just down the street from Coastal Carolina University near Cox Ferry Road off Highway 544. Police say when they arrived, no victims were on the scene, but they later learned of two victims taken to Seacoast Medical Center. Horry County Chief Deputy Coroner Tamara Willard says Caleb died there after being shot. As for the bar, 15th Circuit solicitor Jimmy Richardson says complaints have been made against it, but this deadly shooting could lead to bigger consequences. The shooting is generally, uh, in times past, that's kind of the straw that broke the camel's back. That's what got the community up in arms. Meanwhile, Horry County School says the death of a student has a ripple effect on the school community. They say Laura's High School is providing counseling services to any student or staff at the high school who may be affected by the loss of Caleb. Now we did reach out to Caleb's family, but we're told to respectfully respect their privacy during this time. Uh, it's still not clear if police have made any arrests in connection to the shooting. Live in Laura's Alley Espinosa, WMBF News.